any programs I work with have these uh, menu item list boxes that you come in here, let's say I want to run descriptives, and I can add variables, I can select them here, add them to this window, but what I can't do is just grab them from this window here, which uh, would be nice, one just to know, so I can keep for historic purposes and show what I selected, or sometimes I actually, I want to know what's available to me without coming to this window and having to scroll through and see what's there. So if I actually had the text values of these, it would be helpful. And uh, what I do is I wrote a script on a hotkey that will come in here and extract these. So I can highlight, let's just do a couple first. So I'm going to select these three. And if I hit my hotkey, you notice I have a message box that pops up with the text that was selected. So it's actually reading this value, exporting it, it copies it to the clipboard, and then displays it in my message box just so I can see it. Um, and I can come over here and hit paste, and you can see the values are actually in my clipboard. And let me bring that. Um, the other thing that's helpful is uh, in a program business objects I use, I can only copy up to, I can only select up to 100 things. And if I select, I can actually, I'm sorry, I can select more than 99 things. However, when I go to hit OK, it'll just say you've selected too many items. And so I don't know how many I've selected, and I have to try to randomly unselect some, and it drives me crazy, because then I don't know which one I did and didn't select. I'm tracking it, it's a real pain. Um, so what this allows me to do is I can, not the, the camera goes, uh, I'm going to come in here, and let's say on this file alone, I came in here, and I selected all of them, right? And I'm going to hit my hotkey, and this reads it, and, and you can see there's more than what's shown in this window here. This message box keeps going but I'm going to come back over in here and hit paste and if we scroll down to the end of that you can see roughly there's there's over 3,000 lines um, that were available and now I have these and I can sort them alphabetically I can um, reuse them in any way I want this is actually the text values that were in those so it just gives me that option that now I can look at what I had done what I was working with in that menu, or see all the options, and I can select from them, and then I know going in which ones I want, and I can count, so in my example before, I can select 99. I can break them into um, however many groups of 99 that I need to, and I know that there are 99 there. And I can actually, I wrote another one, um, I don't have it set up where it'll work in this, but it'll, it'll come through and select from this window for me, um, given I tell it these things are the ones I want to select. Um, so let's say I couldn't use syntax. I can still say go select these uh, from this list automatically, which saves me a lot of time. Thanks.